up top here at this last fill site. We uh, thought we'd add this in. They're not running open, but uh, they've run it into a floating strainer, which actually is serving as a diffuser, for lack of a better term. So this, uh, this five inch line right here, that five is the turbo draft. The PVC line is coming from the portable pump. And now they're filling the bass strip tender. And we'll watch this for a little bit. We'll try to see what the water level is here as they're filling. So he's running a manifold. He got the manifold over there. Running five inch direct fill right in. Uh, their goal is 1,000 gallons a minute. And uh, thus far they've been able to keep up. We already see the tank stop overflowing. So we know that we're taking more out than what's coming in, but we want to see where we stand once the tender's full. So we'll watch this for a little bit. This is a good example of the open relay. Water level continues to drop. You can see that we're probably six inches down over here on this side. Uh, we don't know how full the tender is, but we should be able to capture once it's full how much we've taken out of this tank. The dump tank is a 3,000 gallon tank. So the key to making this work is trying to get a big tank here. We're probably down, uh, coming up on 10 inches now on this end of the tank. Still got good flow coming in. And he's full. So that's a 2,000 gallon tender that we just filled up. We used maybe maybe 50%, 60% capacity is left in this dump tank. Uh, so we are clearly able to support that 1,000 gallon minute flow. We would not have been able to do that had we tried to hook that portable pump directly into the tender. So uh, again, a really good example of using the open relay as a means to fill tenders really quick. And in a matter of a couple minutes, this dump tank will be overflowing again as they wait for another tanker to arrive.